Tonight, delivery danger. One family claims a FedEx delivery driver killed their dog. The family of Venice says the delivery driver was reckless and the company's response was not sensitive enough. Yeah, tonight, KCAL9's Jeff Nguyen is live in Venice with a story you won't see anywhere else. Jeff? Susie and Jeff, if you walk through parts of Venice, you will notice a lot of homes sit behind walls. Some are higher than others, which is why one family is handing out this flyer. They believe what happened was the result of a speedy delivery in which a delivery person chucked a box into their yard, which ultimately took the life of one of their family members. Cooper. One look at Cooper seen here with a bow in her hair, and you can see why. She was the center of Mitchell Gallons and Keiko Napier's world. We've just had a horrible weekend. They're blaming a FedEx delivery person for the loss of their four pound Yorkie. They say this large box containing crystal and a second Christmas present was thrown over their fence and into their Venice courtyard on Saturday when Cooper was sunbathing. And so I immediately picked up the box and Cooper was in a puddle of blood. Here are some of Cooper's x-rays. Her vet told us she suffered serious injuries to her lungs and liver. The next day, Keiko and Mitchell chose to have her euthanized. It's painful to watch her dog. You know, in pain. Fed has sent us a statement saying, we extend our deepest sympathies to the family of the pet involved in this incident. We take this matter very seriously and are working directly with those involved to determine the circumstances behind this event. Based on the outcome of our investigation, we will take the appropriate action. They need to say that they're going to institute a corporate-wide mandate that drivers cannot throw packages. And that's what I want to hear. The couple says Cooper used to sleep between the both of them every night. So now they want to prevent drivers from taking what they call shortcuts that could have a lasting impression. Our grandchild plays out here. My mother is out here gardening. I'm here gardening. And the package was so heavy that should it have struck one of us, it would have caused damage, very, very severe damage. The couple says with the holiday season coming, they fear that drivers will be pushed to do more than they already do. So they're hoping some policy changes will take place so that a tragedy like this will not happen again. We're live in Venice. Jeff Nguyen, KCAL 9 News. All right, Jeff, thank you.